What is up guys, in this video we will be creating a Shopify product page using the team Debutify. And if you are new to the team Debutify, welcome to the community. Debutify in my opinion is without a doubt the best Shopify team ever. You can install it for free and the free version of Debutify beats any other free Shopify team out there. Debutify is an amazing team and it has many features built into it. Instead of spending lots of money on Shopify apps, you can simply use Debutify and replace a bunch of those apps. Moreover, Debutify rolls out frequent updates giving you more and more features. Well, I'm not gonna keep talking, I'm just going to jump right into my computer and show you how powerful the team Debutify is and let's build an amazing Shopify product page using the latest Debutify team out there right now. Hello my friends, so the first thing which you need to do is to get the beautify. If you already have the beautify, you can skip to the minute which I'll be showing on the screen right now. But if you don't, make sure you click on the first link in the description. I will also pin the comment down below where you can get the beautify. It's my affiliate link, you can sign up through that if you want to help my channel out. Or you can simply go to thebeautify.com and here we have the beautify. Alright, so the first thing which you need to do is... Uh, just click on try the beautify free you click on that so after that you just have to fill in your name and your email so whatever your name your email and then just click on try the beautify free once again and i want to use the beautify on my new store that's what you want to click and then click on continue and lastly you have to provide your store name dot and after that just click on try the beautify free all right Alright, so after you do that, you come to something like this. It is as simple as installing a Shopify app. Just click on install unlisted app. And that's it. That's how you get the Beautify for free. First thing which you need to do is go to the team library. This is to add the Beautify team into your store. Alright. And then you just have to click on add to team library. And here you can see the current version of the Beautify that is a 4.10 point zero all right so just click on add to team library all right now you can see you successfully added the beautify 4.10.0 and what you can do is you can click on customize team right here but i like to do it from the store because that's why i'm used to so to do that just click on this online store and after that you click on teams all right so once you are in team this is the shopify default team as you can see done and you can customize right but we don't want to use that we want to use this debutify and the first thing which you want to do is just click on this one and you can publish it right if you already have a store created don't publish it publish it only after you finish customizing right but as this is a new store i will simply start by publishing it all right boom done now you can see the dawn is here and the beautify is our current team right and after that you just can click on customize and this is where it will take you to the customization page for shopify and you can customize all the elements the colors and stuff all right the first thing which i want to tell you is that you make sure you know what this is all right so uh this basically uh, the icon right here on top it is showing a uh, desktop right here you can do mobile view which will show you how it will look like on mobile which in my opinion is the most important one all right because 80 percent of people will be viewing from mobile and in case you want to see everything you just can click on this full screen and then you can see how your store is currently looking on a white screen right and desktop this is the one where we will be customizing because we have all the customization features right here First of all, we have come to the product page and when you try to customize uh, the beautify theme, the first thing which you will see is all these things right here with this icon of like a lightning thunder and all these are the add-ons of the beautify. All right. So if any of these doesn't have this uh, lightning symbol, then it is not an add-on. It is actually uh, in the theme. All right. So like the drawer menu announcement header and product paste and other things are uh, like the guarantee section the footer these are all within the team without any add-ons right so uh, if you want to enable or disable any add-ons you cannot do it right from here if you want to see all the add-ons available in the beautify go to this team setting and here you can see the beautify add-ons once you click on that you can enable or disable the add-ons right from here all right that's it and uh, 
uh, whatever here uh, you can find here it is the add-ons that is related to the product page you got it right uh, yeah sort of let's say for example the product bullet points let's try let's click on it and this is right under the product price so it should come right under the product price position left and display inline display all right so if you want to add that you just click on this arrow and then click on this add bullet point all right and then just click on that and you can just type the name as let's say uh, comfortable all right and as you can see it comes right here comfortable in case you want to change this icon of tick mark just click on this view all available icons it will take you to google phones and whatever icon you want you can use it let's say the thumbs up you click on the thumbs up and then this text right here which says thumb up copy this text and then you just paste it right here right where it says icon and then it will sort of thumb up instead of the tick mark all right so you can add a lot of bullet point you can add one more just click on add bullet point and then you can say uh, this is just an example it has nothing to do with the marketing or stuff I'm just showing you all right colorful and you can add whatever you want and things like this uh, announcement bar where you don't see this lining this yellow symbol you don't see this is actually within the theme you get this all for free you don't need to have any pet plan for the beautify to ha uh, to have this one all right so yeah you can modify the text right here so, you know, how, whatever way you want and uh, you can scroll down the header the product page and this guarantee section also it's within the uh, it's with the theme as you can see i modify it so once you tap on that you can modify 97 people like this you can just say good quality all right so the symbol also you can sense it just like we did so just click on all available icons you come to this and whatever symbol you want just copy whatever it is and then you just can paste it all right so the face let's just copy this face and then you come back here and instead of thumb up you just paste it just like that all right and uh, you can add a more guarantee section uh, but by default there are three sections which you can modify all right and when once you go to this product page this is uh, these are the generic things inside the product page you go here you can show banner so SKU product text and stuff you can also customize the gallery layout thumbnails or stack and if you choose the stack it shows like this if you choose thumbnails uh, all the other images goes right at the bottom just like that all right so image size you can make it small medium large whatever you want and here you can see uh, description and stuff so the description you can do in a separate section or right under the add to cart which will show you the default style of Shopify uh, which looks like other team alright so it will be right under the add to cart and it is on this you know right side of the page right this is not bad but uh, of, uh, depending on what product you are selling in a separate section which comes right under all these elements this may be the better option for you all right and you can also align it to the left right all right so these features are things built into the beautify for free you don't need to pay anything and you can also add more section if you click on this add section you can see a bunch of other sections which you can add it has many features you can see and all of these sections which you can add is very very customizable unlike any other team all right so you can even add a video you can add map you can add testimonials you can add slideshow and this slideshow is not like any other free team this is really customizable you can hide on desktop on mobile you can do this one and here the add slide you can add whatever slide you want you can add any number of slides and as you can see right here it has two buttons and this is something you cannot find in any other free Shopify team all right and you can sense both of the buttons you can sense what it says you can sense the text you can sense the phone everything right inside of here all right and if you want you can even make this slide so a video instead of an image i have a video mat on that so if you want your slideshow background to be video i will link my video down below so you can even add a background video instead of an image and keep in mind this is for free all right so you get all these features with the free version of the beautify all right 
the first thing which you need to do when you are in the beautify is change the colors all right so if uh, this purple or violet i'm not sure if you if that doesn't fit your brand just change it uh, you can go to team setting all right and here in colors you can change all these colors right so announcement that we that is the one that should be on top but i think here uh, yeah this one right so the one where it says follow follow us you can change this uh, for this one let's just use blue all right so let's just try something like this one all right so this blue that's it and then next thing is that the header that's fine paste the buttons i like to change it to the blue we just uh, use right as you can see it sends this to the blue and then links and accents uh, right here we send it to the blue as well errors that's fine errors just make it what it is sell the price i will change it to blue all right and then drawer if you don't know what drawer is i will show you what it is when you go to mobile view you see right here uh the menu when you click on that uh it's going to you know show you this one all right so this is called the drawer and also when you click on this card icon this will uh, open up another drawer that will be for the card all right so yeah this is the drawer right yeah so that's the drawer and these are the colors you can change in the drawer all right now let's just cross this out and let's go to the next one the footer all right so the colors of the footer is right here and this is where you change the colors So yeah, that's it. Errors, I would prefer to keep it red. Just keep it red. Alright, so even though we cannot see, uh, see any errors at the moment, just keep it red. Alright. Image overlay. The, this one is for when your image, uh, your, even when you use a banner and stuff. Uh, so always make this dark black. Alright, so you can always play around with the opacity. So yeah, that's it. Now we have a store and we have modified all the colors, right? So now let's start customizing the page, okay? Uh, let's just go to the desktop version of it. And this button, which you can see, this is the scroll to top button. When you click on it, it will just scroll all the way to the top. I prefer to, uh, I prefer that in some other place that is maybe the right side. So to modify that, just go to the advanced setting. And here, all right, so back to top button, you can see so you can hide on mobile, but I would like to keep it on mobile as well. And the position, I want to clip it to the right. All right. You see, it is now at the right side and make sure you save it. All right. All right. So the next thing that you may be wondering is this add to cart right here. So even if you scroll down the page, this add to cart remains on the page. All right. So this is called the floating add to cart by the beautify. So uh, in order for you to get this one, just go to team settings and just click on this debutify add-ons and when you scroll down in this conversion triggers because this will convert more visitors into buyers uh, you can actually see that here it is called a sticky add to cart the next thing which you can see right here it is color swatches so if you have different products you can actually make them see the color and then select the color in that way right so in order to modify it you just have to click on this add color swatches as you can see and then just click on here and then you just type in name right so for example here we have the red and it is showing a basic red all right so uh, if you have like a camo flag you can do that if you have some kind of weird uh, weird color you can all do that all right so for, an, for as an example let's type here red color name let's just say red all right and then the color let me just sense this to something else all right so just to give you an example let's sense this to blue and it will change this one to blue as you can see right here right so uh, in case the red you have in your store is something like a light red or something you can sense it to whatever color you want all right so let's just keep it to ff0000 and you can see it right here all right so you can add any number of colors right in here okay all right as you see the add to cart sometimes sex as you can see uh, this is called the add to cart animation if you want to customize that you go to this team setting and here you can see add to cart animation all right so you can uh you can do this animation type sec x or bounce 
or then flash there are a lot lots of animation all right so let's just uh, do the bounce then it will look like it's bouncing and yeah that's it the next thing is the guarantee step and secure checkout which uh, i believe is the right here the trust beds you can actually add your own trust page okay the image size uh the image you can select it on your own then you can have a separate section or under the checkout button and that's how we customize that all right so after that we have the faq so in case you have faqs for your product you can enable or disable it with the beautify uh, once again team setting the beautify enable or disable it and if you want to customize it the faq is right here if you want to add any question you just click on this add block all right so it will be like this you click on the arrow right down and then click on add block and then you just can do category or you can do question so we just cl click on question as you can see we have a bunch of questions right you can add up to 10 questions and answers right on this page all right so if you want to customize more you just tap on this faq right here and then here you can customize all right so in case you want to align it right or align it center you can do right here all right so you can do it differently for desktop and for mobile all right so you know, once you get that you can also change these titles and stuff faq and stuff just change it okay so if you want to make it uh, faqs add an s you can add just like that by the way we need to remove this one this section doesn't currently have any content so let me just click on this and let's see what it is all right it's also right here it is the testimonials right so uh, let's just remove this section by clicking on remove section all right you can remove it by the way you can also add the testimonials if you want but i prefer to use uh, an, an app to add reviews like you can use judge.me and you can add a review right so in that way your customer can also add reviews and uh, just having a testimonial slide so here doesn't look authentic from our instagram this actually is the the instagram thing let's see uh, yeah here is the instagram feed all right so just click on this instagram feed and then you can provide your instagram url all right the images you upload on your instagram page will be here all right for me i just want to disable it i go here and then all right so it's right here you can see it says instagram feed i will uncheck this one and make this disappear yeah that's it and the next thing is the follow us on social media and as you can see nothing is showing up right here for that you actually need to add your you know social media and you can add it right here social media share on facebook and stuff you have to provide your facebook link instagram link whatever link you want to provide and it will show off the icons right here all right and at the footer you can actually change all this footer in the uh, footer section as you can see you can uh, you see here you can even add some menu if you want you can also uh, disable the newsletter you can add a menu you can share your store information right here about us you can sense all this right here and uh, the last one is where it says powered by Shopify team by the beautify uh, you can also remove this one without having to modify team files all right so just click on this footer and then here you can uncheck so uh, powered by Shopify so powered by the beautify all right so now it says copyright c 2022 the beautify tutorials this is the name of the store so if your store name is you know michael enterprise it will be copyright c 2022 michael enterprise all right that's it my friend that's how you create an amazing product page using the beautify as you can see the free the beautify has a lot of features built into it but once you upgrade you get a lot more features which are just mind-blowing all right and you can stand out of the competition because the beautify is highly customizable and you can customize your store to you know to make it look completely different from any other store right and make sure you check the first link in the description to install the beautify if you have any question on how to customize or if you have if you encounter any problem when using the beautify let me know just in the comment down below and i will definitely reply to your comment and help you out all right so that's it and uh, yeah see you in the next video thank you